It's so meaning for you. It is so meaning for me called God preached it and I preached it. And I've been just thinking about it. You can count on me. Oh my God. That's just like God, isn't it? He could be you put everybody else turn their back on you. Oh my God. Jesus said you can count on me. Huh? When they start talking about you, Jesus still standing right there. He had need of you. And saying you can count on me. That's what kind of environment I'm trying to get in and get around. An environment that I can count on you. Because Jesus said we can count on him. Amen. Second King, the fourth chapter. One through seven of the Lord's will. I want to say again, pray for Brother Jackie. Your sister told me this morning that the ambulance had come get him. He was feeling that bad. We praying for him. In the name of Jesus. And in the midst of it yesterday, he had went home deep for his lost his body. And I said, Lord, help him. But since she told me, I've been praying, Lord, Lord, make him bring him back. Make him bring him back. Lord, Lord, make him bring him back. Teacher, I'm going to say, y'all, we need to start using the power we got. See, we got no power that he dropped the water so somebody picked it up. But at the same time, get the money out of it if you want it. But when God can touch their heart, and they can take them back to the store manager or sitting on the counter where you can get all the information. Somebody say, Lord, make them bring it back. Say it one more time. Lord, make them bring it back. Say what? Thy servant, my, my husband, is dead. 
wait a minute. He said, your servant, who is my husband, is dead. What's dead around you right now? What seems like it's not moving in your life right now? What seems like hindering and holding you back right now? But I hear this certain woman coming up on a problem or a situation in her life. But I see that she needs help. But she hears to tell her vision that my servant, your servant, my husband is dead. Let us know that she needs help today. So let us help me, Lord. Free car rentals in Houston, Texas. Look no further than Twirl Me Car Rentals. We take pride in being the go to place for renting cars with easy terms and affordable rates. Whether you need a car for a day or a week, we've got you covered. Booking a car with us is a breeze. You have two convenient options instant online booking or simply text CR to 346 699 4115 and we'll handle the rest. No need to waste time with lengthy paperwork or complicated procedures. Value your time and strive to make the rental process as seamless as possible. At Twirl Me Car Rentals, 
we understand the importance of flexibility, it's why our terms are designed to suit your needs. Whether you're a local or a traveler exploring Houston, we offer flexible daily and weekly rates. Abroad, abroad, all thy neighbor. 
workers in the empty vessels, but are not a few. So wait a minute, say you don't have that, do you? Oh, I asked her, well, you need a miracle, you need a miracle. But you say you don't have nothing. Well, she said, I just had uh, one pot of oil. He said, well, guess what, dear? See, God can use whatever you got. So God told this woman, he said, Lord, I want you to do it. I want you to knock on your neighbor, though. I want you to knock on your prayers door. I want you to go around the corner and knock on the church miller door. And the Bible said he told her to get one pot up or get pots up. Pots to come over and bring back up. Wait a minute now. I thought you said it only on the head. Only one pot of oil. But what I see God been to do when you trust God. Somebody said when you trust God. next week as Pastor Holmes dives deeper into this extraordinary message titled If You Trust God, Something Good Will Happen. You're listening to Robert Holmes Gospel The station that reminds you God is always there